our national passenger rail system is in crisis. In June of 2012, Via Rail management announced cutbacks in both frequency and employment at Via Rail. Government projections for 2013 and 2014 suggest that Via Rail's funding is set to be cut by 65%. Now, while Canadian governments were fixated on cutting Via Rail's funding, competing jurisdictions such as France, Germany, and Japan invested heavily in public rail. Germany spends twice as much, France three times as much, the United Kingdom six times as much, and China 15 times as much on national rail infrastructure. We think it's long past time for Canada to catch up with the rest of the advanced industrial world. So we're calling on the Government of Canada and the opposition parties, provincial, municipal governments, via rail and other stakeholders to participate in a national discussion about the future of passenger rail. There are strong economic arguments that talk to the, the value of putting an investment like this in place. And so as cities, as we look to grow our economies and stabilize our, our tax base and, and create the technology and the infrastructure required to compete globally, we look to projects like this and to leadership coming from organizations like yours that create the context for us to, and create the platform for us to compete globally using rail as the spine of, 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 that, of that growth. What we really are looking at here with this investment is a huge investment in developing municipal financial and manufacturing infrastructure and that's why it's such a great investment because it does all of those things with one play and with one investment and that's why Ottawa Queens Park and the cities need to partner to make this a reality. A government cannot cut 65 percent over four years to the passenger rail service and expect that it's going to get better. As a nation, we're supposed to be connecting the communities. We're supposed to be connecting people. We're supposed to have an infrastructure in, in, in place that brings together our manufactured goods, but more importantly, moves people to their work. Think of what's happening in China. Think about what's happening in Japan. Think about countries that are investing in infrastructure and the jobs that are associated with it. Think about what happens to those 400 young people who are hired in Thunder Bay to build light rail cars for the TTC. If you want to talk about putting people to work, be strategic. Create an environment that A, puts people to work, B, makes them consumers, but C, invests in our communities and the infrastructure in order to make Canada stronger. Are we afraid to have the debate? Are we afraid to push for change? Are we afraid to have a creative strategy that says this is the nation we want and we're prepared to fight for it? So that's what this is all about. This is about the debate about our infrastructure. This is about the debate of our economy. And this is our message saying to young people that there's a role for you in, in Canada.